Over several years, elders from the Ute Indian tribes have been coming together with scientists for learning and collaboration. Ute elders have shared traditional ecological knowledge, the knowledge of their environment and the innovations that Ute people developed and pass on over centuries of living in the Colorado mountains. The archaeologists have shared how Western science and technology can help us to understand the past. Because our ancestors were scientists. They um, conducted experiments all the time. You know, I bet there were times where they ate something that didn't agree with their stomach, and that was kind of an experiment. So then they didn't go back there, but they found another use perhaps for it. So maybe they could have made it more of a materialistic use. So I think it's important to remember that no matter which culture you're talking about, there are scientists in, across the board. It's not just central to the, the Europeans or the Greeks, you know. There were scientists before they knew they were scientists. So, and there were astronomers before there were astronomers. So it's just really important to understand those, those uh, dichotomies and not just rely on one strict definition. My personal uh, aim in all of this is of reconnection of you people with the land in Colorado. That's my whole thing because we can talk all day long, we can show move, we can make movies, we can build museums, but it's the land that actually informs all of us, in my opinion. And that, to me, is the most important thing, and it's that whole human-land interface is what changes people, in my, my feeling. In the summer of 2017, a group comprised of Ute elders, archaeologists, and Ute youth met near Montrose, Colorado to visit historic Ute Indian cultural sites. I'm I'm native and I want to learn how they um, how they lived here. Why they stay here? Did they stay there for a long time? It's cool to see how technology works with uh, with all these old uh, artifacts and uh, what they can do with them and with technology and uh, and hopefully that we can explore more with technology. Well, to me, I think it's a really good opportunity for our our children to carry this on. And at least, you know, they would go back and tell the parents, not only the parents, but their friends that they hang around with, you know, and uh, and tell them, hey, you know what? There's this place up there that they've seen and hardly none of our kids will really get to see it. 